Jared Poland, Frono's Photo. Dot com here with a 30 for 30 Lightroom quick tip video brought to you by the fine people over at Adobe. If you want to follow along, you can go to fronosphoto.com slash LR3030. You can download a free trial of Lightroom so that you can play along with all of the videos that we're making. So let's get started. Here we have a quick tip about loop view. Now loop view doesn't give you a lot of information to make you figure out what it is, but once you see how to use it, it's, it's something that you're not gonna wanna have turned off. I use it all the time, but let's show you what we do. So right now I'm in the develop module. I go ahead and go to view and I hit loop info, show info overlay. Another way that you can get through this is you hit the I button and it cycles through that. Right now it's off. I'm gonna go ahead and put it back on and it's showing me the file name and it's giving me, I guess, the date that I took it with the exact time as well as the dimensions of the image. Now that doesn't help me out too much. I want it to show different things. So let me show you how you can make those changes. You go to view, then you've got view options and you can see right here, I can change file name. I'm gonna leave file name because I like to see the file name. But I could say, oh, why don't I show something like, what else could we show? ISO, focal length. Let's show focal length. Then I could change this one and we could say exposure time. You can see what's going on right here on the screen. It's showing you a couple of different options that you can do. Or you could change this even more and hit camera plus lens. And there you see the camera, the lens that was shot, and you can see there's a lot of different options that you have. Now you can change between loop view option one and loop view option two, so you can make different changes that you want that work best for your personal workflow. But this is a quick tip just showing you how to make those changes inside a loop view, and if you wanna check out more 30 for 30 Lightroom Edition videos, you can go to fronosphoto.com slash LR3030. You can also download a free trial of Adobe Lightroom and try it out for yourself and play a along with all of these videos that we're putting out a part of this 3030. So that is where we're going to leave this quick tip. Jared Poland, fronosphoto.com. See ya.